Hi everybody, my name is Chris from Reading Town and thank you for joining us today for Junior Times. Now today's topic is especially special for me or close to me because I am also a fan of this amazing sort of fantasy world or game and it is Pokemon and specifically we're going to talk about the new Pokemon application called Pokemon Go. All right, so go catch them all. That's the catchphrase or the motto of Pokemon, right? Gotta catch them all. The Pokemon radar is going crazy. The radar is of course, you know, something that we use to find something in like a submarine. At last, it's the famous yellow electric mouse, Pikachu, perched on your teacher's desk. Perched means it's sitting somewhere like a bird, right? The, la the latest sensation, Pokemon Go, finally makes it possible for anyone to catch them all, right? The reason we put them in here because we're not physically catching things and putting it into a bag, right? It's really just a computer thing. It's like sort of fake catching. The makers of the game, Niantic, used Google's real world map technology and Nintendo Pokemon, Nintendo's Pokemon universe to create a global phenomenon. So like a global uh, exciting activity or a, a, like an unbelievable activity. So what they did was this game company Niantic, they used the Google's map application where people use for navigation and they used the Nintendo's characters and when they put them together, you know, that's Pokemon Go. Beloved by all ages, these cute creatures have had a huge fan base since 1996. Uh, fan base are the people that love Pokemon, right? There's a lot of people. We call that a fan base. When Nintendo launched the first Pokemon video game in 1996. Launched, it means like a rocket is launched into outer space. But launched also means when you're starting a project or starting a company. The game's mission, the game's goal was to capture or catch, train, and fight other Pokemon, short for pocket monsters, right? Pokemon's attractiveness, attractiveness means what people, what the good things about it, what people like about it, is it pretty, is it fun? Spread worldwide after launching its own television series, merchandise, which is like pens and books and bags, films like movies, toys, trading cards, and dozens of other video games. Does, one dozen is 12, so dozens is more than, you know, like 24. What makes Pokemon Go special? Well, first, AR, augmented reality. Augmented means it's sort of a little change, it's slightly changed, right? Maybe like 10% is changed. Reality, technology has completely changed the user's experience. So what they're saying is, we have technology like the map technology, right? But because we're infusing or sort of combining it with fantasy, that's why we say it is augmented reality. It's not Google Maps, it's augmented, it's a little fantasy. Um, while taking a stroll or taking like a leisurely walk down the street, Google finds the user's location using satellites, right? They know where you are. And a special breed of Pokemon will appear only in that area, in that region. So, you know, I'm sure you already know how to play Pokemon Go, right? You go on your smartphone, <clears throat> they know your location, and on your phone, you can see where you have to find a special uh, Pokemon. A special breed means a special type of Pokemon. Motivated to move, young gamers can no longer just sit on the sofa like a couch potato, and parents are thrilled. They're very happy because the kids have to exercise. Many people are already going around their local area, like cl close by area, place, to catch their Pokemon. However, be warned, be careful, some users have fallen off of cliffs. 
Cliffs are mountains, people. People are dying, so be careful. Or have been robbed by other gamers. Robbed is when someone steals your Pokemon, right? Using, um, you know, violence. You can become the next, oh, but that doesn't stop anyone from playing. You can become the next Ash Ketchum. Go catch your Pokemon today. All right, we have three review questions here. A, how did Niantic, the creators of Pokemon Go, create the Pokemon Go game? They combined Google's real world map blank and Nintendo's Pokemon universe. They combined it together, right? So Google's real world map, this is sort of, has to do with computers and satellites and science and machines. So we can say it is technology. Technology has to do with advanced computers and bigger machines and faster machines and smarter computers and that's what technology is. B, why are parents thrilled with the game? Why are they happy with the game? <clears throat> Young gamers won't just sit on the sofa to play the game, but they have to blank. So the opposite of sitting on the sofa and not moving the opposite, of course, would be being active. It is to move. So the opposite of move is, you know, sit still, right? And if you're moving, you're moving like this. C, why do you have to be careful when you play the game, right? They said beware, right? Because you can fall off a cliff or be blank by other gamers as some users have already experienced. So these other gamers, they're not very nice. They're, you know, bad people, they're robbers, they're criminals, to be honest, and they can steal your Pokemon. And another way we can say steal is to rob or be robbed, right? So when you are robbed, then someone is taking something from you, okay? <clears throat> We're gonna review three key terms here that we learned. A, these cute creatures have had a huge blank since 1996. So over, you know, like 20 years ago, they already had a lot of people that love this game, right? So we call these people fans. Um, so a fan base is all the fans put together, we call that a fan base, right? So we can say the people that love Pokemon, when we put them all together, it's a very large number of people. B, the game's blank was to capture, to catch, train, and fight other Pokemon. So the game's sort of goal or the game's you know, main aim was to catch them, is their mission. So a mission is their final goal. What do they really want to do? What's, what's the end of Pokemon? Is it just to walk around or is it to you know, catch other Pokemon? See, many people are already going around their blank area to catch their Pokemon. So they're already walking around their area around their house, right? Again, it's around their house. It's not they're going to far away places. It's just very close by areas. And we say that is local. So your local library is, you know, right there. It's close to your house. It's not far away. Um, your local uh, candy store is, again, very close to your house, all right? So to review, fan base is talking about all the people that love something, right? Mission is a goal or what you want to achieve or want to accomplish. And local just means something that's very close by. We're talking about distance, how far something is. It's not far, it's close by, all right? So I know everyone wants to really try Pokemon Go, but always remember to be safe while you're playing this game, all right? So thank you for joining us today for Junior Times. My name's Chris from Reading Town. I'll see you next time.